Wow, I actually got it. I've been having trouble with this. 54 minutes. I feel like I need a little more. When maybe, 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 maybe. I'm an idiot. Do it a little harder. Do you feel it? The darkness in KCNN. The radioactive air, thick and suffocating, yet thin. What if you were told that the safety of everyone you knew and love fell on the hands of you finding some stupid fucking water chip that can't be found? Worse, actually, you know where it's at, but you can't get to it. You're too weak. You're not smart enough. Hell, you're not even, you're not even dumb enough. Your fa friends and family misled you. All right, enough venting. Let's get this water chip. <laughs> like, I don't even know if the water chip actually exists in this game. They just set you up for a fail. Like, the point of this game is to never actually achieve the water chip. You just fail. In all honesty, this is actually a real good example of how old school games and things used to work back in the day. Like, a game like this, there's so much to it. So much to it. Like, more to it than, like, even D&D &D or anything like that. There's, like, way more to it. And I'm unaware about all of it. And the only way you really find out is by reading a big booklet sized guide or just kind of going through the painstaking experience of learning everything. And in this kind of a method, it would take forever. Like, I mean, everything is hidden. Everything is kind of secretive. It's unwritten rules, essentially. Our goal here was to get past this guy in here. I'll go in there just to initiate a combat with him. His name was Harry, if you don't remember from last hey, episode. You not but like I cannot I'll get come. past him for the very reasons I speak of. My sneak's not high enough. My speech is not high enough. I'm not dumb enough either. And uh, obviously I can't beat him. He's a super mutant. I haven't been side quests or anything, so I have no experience, no nothing, or no personal experience either at this game. But I have been getting some help from some comments, and I really, truly appreciate it. A couple good comments from some good Samaritans right here. I'm going to look real stupid if I don't figure out how to put those there. <laughs> Including one particular good Samaritan that uh, gave me, like, paragraphs of valuable information. Like, actually, information that you learn through experience. So it was very helpful, very helpful, and I really appreciate it. However, don't underestimate my ability to <laughs> screw this up. This is a new play. I am a noob. This is a new play. All right, let me just get the, out of this You're real quick. Now, the two main points I want to mention that he uh, he pointed out for me was that I'm stupid. Not really. He didn't point that out. I'm just like, wow, okay. That's pretty simple, pretty accurate. So, like, if I have this guy here, I supposedly right-click, and I can change burst to, oh, my goodness. What was the target at the bottom? Reload. Single. Single with an aimer? Headshot? Critical hits? Criticals? Are these gonna dish out criticals? Burst. That is fantastic. I really appreciate it. Also, too, I'm not leveling up. I gotta go to my character sheet. Which, I do not know what that is. Oh yeah, that switches my weapons. It's been a minute. It's been a minute. I... Get a little bit of time in between my recordings. Ah, that's what it is, isn't it? I remember seeing Map, I remember seeing Pip, and I remember seeing Cha, and I'm like, what is Cha? Character. Ah, ha, ha, and I've already clicked on this. I'm so dumb. Ooh, I can uh, get some of my skill points back, or do I have, let's see. Okay, I can't detriment that. Ah, okay. So I did actually... He told me this, but I had already figured it out in my last recording. But when he told me this, he told me it during an episode where I hadn't figured it out yet. So I still appreciate it. I still, I still really appreciate it because it is huge, huge, useful information. All right, now that we did that, let's see. 116 days left. That's not terrible. That's not terrible. That's actually a decent amount of time. And I did a little more uh, research this time. I got a little more, uh, I did a little more forensics, let's call it, even though forensics is not the right word. But I found out some useful information that might be able to get us progressing. One of the things I was going to do 
was do a little more side questing to help us like level up and get to where we need to be. I found the perfect side quest. If you don't remember the water pump side quest that we did, apparently that can get me through possibly right now. So we're going to try this. That's going to be our episode. Now, how I do this, if you don't remember, we talked to a non ferro ghoul that wanted us to fix this water pump. And if we fix that water pump, he also reveals the location of Vault 12. Now, in order to fix that water pump, I need to get scraps or something. And those are actually in here. Guarded by Larry. Harry. Larry. Harry. Larry. Harry. Larry. Let's see if we could sprint in here. And... Don't see me. Get down there. He's clueless. Oh, he's very clueless. Because I did not... Wow. It says it's guarded by Larry. He's not doing much guarding, let me tell you that. And in the very far east side... I didn't see the actual video of them doing this. I should have known that it was... And there they are. <laughs> Why? Do you see how many mutant bears are there? Oh, those are pig rats. No, those ones are pig rats. Those are the big boys, too, no less. Oh, God. All right, I don't know if burst is probably the best for this guy. <laughs> wow. I mean, that was brutal. That was gruesome. Do I have to reload now? Thank you. Come here. I'm not scared of you. Get closer. Good rodents. What are you, a mole rat? Let's get your friend. Oh, I gotta reload. Oops. I could dish out criticals. But I am not a smart man. Oops. Not enough action points. I gotta run away. Just kidding. Wow. Wow. This changes the game. This changes the game. I gotta reload. Wow. And he also gave me some useful information uh, about uh, Stimpax. Hello, friend. And that I don't need to use too many action points using them. Oh, I'm in a single shot. No. Ow, my ankles. Ow, my other ankle. Just a flesh wound. Did I miss? I think I'm going to go back to a single because I need to save my ammunition at this point. And I think this guy only has a single shot left away from death. I was correct. The math seemed right there. And I got another fella coming this way. No, he has no clue I'm here. So this is actually working out pretty well for us. This is actually working out pretty well for us. Once I get these scraps, if I go back to... Um, and this was like a, a special tactic. This is actually a perfect example of what I mean by unwritten rules and hidden things. But if I get the scraps and I go back to the unfair ghoul before the water pump, I can actually get three booklets that aid in my repairing things and that's that's like something no one would ever think about no one would ever do unless you read a guidebook I think I'm gonna single shot the mole rat maybe usually one shot hit, kills these guys also too it seems that if I get my sneak up to 40% sneak uh, at 40% might be enough for me to get through which means we might get, be getting this water chip this episode. Which would be fantastic. Fantastic. 27%. Probably because I'm bursting from far away. Oh, my stim packs. I need to use some stim packs. Did you miss all of those? Dude, he's right in front of you. Okay, I don't need to reload every time. I thought I did. It was the action points that was my fault, I'm pretty sure. We go to single, because I am single. 
I actually enjoy being single. It's, it's not bad. I enjoy it. He's getting weird on us. What is he even talking about? I'm gonna kill this rat. Fuck, I have to reload. Let me kill this rat. I just need to get away from this dude. Wow. We're doing well. So the tips helped out. Uh, got a little bit more research this time. We might be getting that water chip. We might be getting that water chip, which is crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. I got no help here from Max Critical Stone here with the Battle of the Minds against Harry and him. What was that? Uh... You could hear that? I've been hearing all the stupid shit you've been saying. Uh, I, I'm sorry, I, I just... Are you really gonna try and talk yourself out of this? I... Would you like me to deliver you a critical? You're right, my bad. We can just drop it. You mean you'll drop it? Okay. I didn't actually know you could hear me. I'm in a difficult spot now, I'm a little embarrassed. Oh, the Larry, that's right. Apparently he uh, doesn't care. Oh, Larry, really? You gotta smell it. Oh, you heathen. I did not need to see that, Larry. We are gonna go back to that unfair ghoul, get our repair booklets. So one of the dangerous things about this game, and like I said with old school games and guide booklets and not knowing what you're doing, is you can create, there's tons of builds you can create for a character and tons of updates and things you can do to progress. And if you don't do the right direction, your build will crumble on itself and you will have a hard time possibly not being able to finish, not being able to beat the game. I got here pretty quickly. There's no way I probably would get here this quickly if it wasn't for the fact that I was looking stuff up. This game is well involved. Here's our guy. Thank you for not shooting first. Can I help you with anything? I already told you yes. Alright, well I guess I'm going to have to go through this dialogue again. I'm not going to make you guys sit through it. I just remembered I turned my mic up so I wouldn't have it so close to my face, but I'm just so used to having it close to my face because I like swallowing my mic for some reason. Huh, here we go. This time I, I have a new dialogue because I didn't have the parts last time. Do you mean these parts? You showed the parts found to the ghoul? Yes, those are the parts I was talking about. Thank the flow that you already have them. <laughs> well, that's as close as they're going to get to the water pump. Man, a lot of sarcastic... Uh, a lot of sarcastic throws. Is there anything else I should know? Well, it looks like you may need some help with the parts. Here are some books that we have found littered around. They may help you. Now please take the parts to the watershed and repair the pump. Yes. But I don't know how to read. I, 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 I don't know how to read these books. All right, but I will go ahead and put this in there. I'm sure use it myself. I'm smarter. You learned a lot about repairing broken electronics. Oh, hello. I do that a lot. I do that a lot. Oh my god, I did it again. <laughs> While being aware about it. Just do these real quickly. There we go. Three books read in a real short amount of time. I don't know how I did that. I got real close to my mic again. Wow. What am I doing? We now know a tremendous amount about repairing electronics, and all we gotta do is somehow get my sneak to 40% plus, and then we go repair that water pump, just cause, I mean, we did all the work to do it, and then we can just walk, hopefully walk, right to the pump. Oh, but that's right. What's going on right now? Why can't I? Oh, there we go. Some of the simplest tasks are just so hard for me. Once we repair this water pump, we get headed towards the chip. The thing is, there's feral ghouls down there. 
Actually, they're like guarding. They're like non-feral ghouls, but they're uh, guarding something. Like they're very non-feral, but they don't like you being there. They don't like you being there at all. It's like if you showed up at a military base and they're like, turn around. Ooh, ooh, I don't have any sneak on yet. I don't have any sneak on yet. Good job, dude. I should use my stim packs as well. Now, I think... There's something I learned as well. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. That's what he was talking about. He was telling me for the stim packs specifically. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Open up a character sheet. My sneak is at 32. Yeah, I think I already did this and it was at 45% the last time I did it. So, I should be able, I think it was sneak I needed to do. Yeah, so maybe I just have to keep trying because one of the things I found out too is it does kind of work like D&D &D in a sense of uh, dice rolls and uh, chances. So not only is it percentage based, but you have chances so it's not like you need 50 percent at least to get through and buy him you need a certain amount but it's still up to the roll of the dice and even the more you get i guess the better your roll is but wild also two i gotta find out my preferences apparently there is an option that says always move or always running Running. Always normal. Okay, normal is what I want. Okay. Now we will save game. Because I am a noob and I need to do that. Now we turn on sneak. Like this. Let's hope. Let's hope. I'm sneaking. Stay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, get in there. It's working. Last episode was stressful for me. It wasn't like I spent a whole lot of time, a whole lot of effort. But I really was upset that I got stopped by that guy. Alright, now we repair. Water pump isn't working. Water pump isn't working. Like I said, it's up to the chance of a dice. Uh oh. I might not have enough repair. Anyways. No. Please don't. No. We don't need this done anyways. Oh yeah. We don't need this done anyways. But man. I did all that work. I guess I did all that work to get our water chip. It doesn't really matter. If they get their water. It matters if my people get my water. Although. In real life. I, I would definitely not throw people under the bus like that i would definitely try and help like in this situation i would actually be like oh my god now i gotta go read some more books and figure some stuff out and i 100 percent would do that not in this video game though not in a video game I'm trying to get a water chip not just for our people but for you guys as well for you guys as well all right i've tried way too many chances for me to really think did i though did i did i Damn it, man. It's not going to work. I don't know how electronics... Electronic. Why do you keep making me do this? You realize it's a 0%, right? Alright, I think we're... I think we're going to progress. But... We... Might be getting the water chip this episode. We might be getting the water chip this episode. Which would be crazy. It'd be crazy. There's the vault. Nice. And we got one more vault to go to before we are where we need to be. I wasn't expecting to have somewhat of a smooth episode, actually. Um, 
So we might actually get this water chip. And if we do do that, here's the ghouls. These guys are on guard. And there's two there. Let's see what else we got. I need to know where the water chip is. Do I go up? I have to probably go up the elevator. Monitors, yeah. It's not going to be here. It's got to be in the command center. I don't, it's probably going to be where it was supposed to be in my vault. All right. Once we get this water chip on our next mission, I am going to do all I can to try and get my character leveled up on the way. You tread without permission. <laughs> I don't need permission. Thanks for the hit. Now, how would you like a burst? It's what happens when you're a non-feral ghoul. You make it easy. Thank you. Hasta la vista. That was easier than I expected, because I did not know the powerful weapon that I actually had, and that it was actually all up to me not putting on burst mode. Get a few extra shots in there on a turn. Getting some headshots too, no less. Unreal, unreal. Game got so much, so much smoother. So this vault is still active. I'm supposed to. Oh, do I just walk in there? That's probably it. Ooh, I haven't seen this yet. Vault Tech. I think it was three. Hello, ghouls. These ones are probably feral. Oh, I'm here getting the water chip. I don't have permission to be here, obviously. They're going to have guards here, obviously. We got some lockers. I need to, like I said, we're going to level up our character. We're going to get what we need. I need stim packs. I need some. I got to make sure I loot on the way, too. I can't run out of the stuff just because I find the water chip. That's not my final mission. <laughs> it's, it's, it seems like it'd be my final mission for me because, holy crap, this has been insane. Insane. When he told me to go find the water chip, I'm like, oh, easy. <laughs> easy. Little did I know. Nothing in that locker? Is it just up to my shitty luck? Oh, sweet. I've been looking for some of my shitty luck. This is the command center over here. What is... He probably came for a water chip. I bet you he came for a water chip. Do we talk to him? A dirt nap. <laughs> uh, <t> what? <laughs> can can I read that again? A dirt nap will be given if alterations are made. Last one here tried. Okay. Computer. Hi. Just walk right through them. Apparently those ones are non-feral, but I'm going to have to deal with these guys. <sighs> you say a water processing control computer is functioning. About fucking time. This has been... A disastrous journey. I can only hope that when I grab this water chip, these ghouls don't try and take me out. But it doesn't matter, because it will be them that gets taken out. You gain 2,500 experience points for getting a water chip. Wow. Wait, do I? Does that mean... Bonus HTH damage. Experience an unknown card that has given you the edge when it comes to damage. You cost plus two da points of damage with hand to hand and melee attacks for each level of this perk. And then 13 more points. Absolutely. But should I save these in case I need them for something in particular in the future? I almost feel like I should. Maybe I should save these for the next mission because things are going smooth. Things are going smooth. All right, back to it. On our way to give this water chip to what's his name? Who cares? I'm Max Critical Stone. That's all that matters. The flow ends. So does your life. Actually, it is your life that is about to end. 
Here. You want some starburst? Get it? I'm sorry, that was terrible. Oh, wow. You're alive. I guess you really like those starbursts. Ow. It's okay, though. Have these ones. Shit. I used an action point. Burst. Oh, no. This is not looking good. Die. It is you that will die. That one hurt. Here, have some more. Your number is up. Looks like your numbers are down. God damn it. Eat lead. Oh my goodness. Hmm. Decreasing numbers. Unfortunate. Hey, what's up? You recognize what's going on? <laughs> wow. I see. You baited me. Smart. That's why I work out. Intelligence is not my thing. Wow. We have the water chip. This is a successful day. Successful day. My only thing is now, on my way to this guy to give him the water chip, am I going to have trouble? Like, I am so used to having trouble. Trying to get this water chip has got me very concerned about my future all the time. Outside of the game as well. Outside of the game as well. No, not really. But, here I am. Treading this journey I have. Just to return this water chip I found. Like, do I have to have my aimer right on the... That's why this entire time... Why not just get this whole entire thing a hitbox? Wow, the rest of your mechanics aren't even that in tuned. Probably because it would have been harder. So precise. Alright. And now we sprint our ass out of here. And we go back. I just gotta turn on sneak. Wait, wait, stop, 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 stop. We gotta turn on sneak. And also, we need to use some stim packs, son. I don't think I... Do I have any... I got one more stim pack. Good for now. I gotta keep that in mind. I gotta get some more before the next episode or during the next episode. We're still on sneak, right? Yes. Alright, please don't get seen. Sprint out of here. Yay. Ooh! What? Oh, it's I sprinted out of there. That was my fault. I was an idiot. Don't shoot me, please. Don't shoot me, please. I just got this water chip, Harry. Harry, I just got this water chip. I don't think right now is a good time to save after all of that. Harry, 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 no. <laughs> no. Don't tell me. I, it's been so long since I saved. It's been so long since I saved. My mistake. Come on, no. They got... Don't tell me they have more than six action points. No. No. Harry. Harry. I see my escape. Harry. Don't. Harry. 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 No. Is he using all his action points to follow me right now? Oh, that is the best case scenario. Please keep doing that, Harry. He missed. He missed. He missed. He missed. He missed. Oh. No! No. Don't do not do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> Nobody challenges us and lives. I think that's the case. Ow! I think that's the case. I mean, why are you guys getting a second turn? Why? Because I'm terrified? I've been petrified. Get in there, get in there, get in there, get in there, get in there. Not enough action points. Oh, screw you. Don't shoot me from way back there. Where are you going? Forget this. 
No. Larry missed. That one's Larry. Are you standing on top of it and I can't get in it now? <sighs> Fuck you. Well, that was alarming. Save game. I don't know if this is the proper time to do it, but this is a safe time to do it. All right, and now I'm assuming they have to be, like, just by the game's mechanics, they have to be, like, back in their locations. Oh, God, no, they're not. They're still... Oh! Oh! They don't care about me no more. Oh... Let's go get this. Let's return. Where, what am I? What am I doing? I bet you, if I go this way, there's probably a way to leave just this place. I was concerned about that. Okay. We tried. There's probably an area around here where I maybe can walk out of here, but I'm not gonna look for that. I'm just gonna go where I know there's an area I can leave. Wait. I hope I don't have to fight these guys on the way back let me guess they're gonna they're gonna know I stole the water chip and I'm gonna have to fight them I don't have any stim packs either so this isn't good this isn't good I bet you I'm gonna have to fight these ghouls I bet you I'm gonna have to fight these ghouls I really hope I can get past these ghouls and they have no clue what's going on but I bet you he's gonna say something to me about the water chip I bet you he's gonna say something to me about the water chip Please talk to our leader before you leave. No. No. <laughs> He's gonna initiate combat. I'm positive. Wait a sec. Oh, yeah. I think it was this one I went through. Now, those ghouls are feral. Those ghouls are feral. But I can dodge them. Weave around here. However, Max Critical Stone can't help himself and absolutely loves combat loves combat and he'll just zigzag over to him sometimes like where are you going right now okay and then we leave slowly apparently because he is not scared and hopefully we don't find trouble on the way this is a momentous day this deserves celebration There's no trouble on the way. I'm actually disappointed. There we go. The fuck? Quack. What the fuck? Quack. There's a ground worm or something, isn't there? What the fuck? Quack. There's got to be like a sandworm or some kind of, what, what are they called, tremors or something? There's got to be something. What the fuck? Quack. Vault 15. Vault 15 is not where I need to go. Vault 13 is where I need to go. Vault 15 was the first vault I went to that's abandoned. <sighs> I'm an idiot. I got to go... This way. This is where I gotta go. Maybe we'll find more trouble. Maybe we'll find trouble. Actual trouble. What's happening? This is bait, isn't it? You see fruit in a bag. Alright, you know what? We're gonna see if we can grab this stuff real quick. But I have a feeling something it's baiting me. Hmm. Piece of candy. Hmm. Piece of candy. What is this? Alright, I'm curious. What's around here? Absolutely nothing. So let's progress. Like what is this area? What is the point of this? Like, is it so does that not mean all the time there's trouble? I have a point of interest or something? What was the point of interest there? All right, now I don't want to find any trouble. We did it twice. We did it twice already. 
Oh, I got a reminder message on my way. Guys, I'm right around the corner. I'm right around the corner. That must mean 100 days left or something like that. I'm right here, man. Two days later, I show up. They're like, hey, hey we just messaged you. I'm like, I know I ignored it. Let's go to the entrance because we have not explored this vault yet. That is not the entrance. This is the entrance. So right down here. Okay. Interesting. Is this the... No. Cool. Looks like a standard vault that isn't destroyed and abandoned. Why is it a different color? Lighting. Oh, man, this is... Hey, let me get in there. <laughs> Ooh, lunch. I'm hungry. You know how long it's... Wait, do you guys have stuff for me? Like, if, if I open these... Like, is there, like, supplies in here I can grab? Like, I need... <sighs> Is this water canteens? I haven't needed to drink water this entire time. What am I supposed to do with these? Whatever. All of them. Give me all of these. Oh. Max critical stone. Did you just take all 40 of our water canteens that we have for everybody here? Yeah, I mean. Oh, look. There's two more. Max critical stone. Did you just take... All 42 of our water canteens that we have for people here? Yeah, these, uh, muscles don't build themselves. Not one calorie left behind. What is this? Well, I'm having a field day right now. This is, oh, yay, some more of my shitty luck. Ah, oh, man. Ugh. Even my bad luck is here. I'm getting sick of my shitty luck at this point. <gasps> the lockers are fucking empty. Why? Except for the one. Sorry, excuse my language, but the lockers are fucking empty. <gasps> Thank you. <laughs> this is what I need. Hallelujah. 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 No more lockers? Okay. Okay. I think we finally get to return this chip, man. <gasps> There's the character I was in the first time I played this. It was uh, Lucy McLean because of the show. There's Lucy McLean. Hey, Lucy. Who is this, actually? You see Vault 13 officer. Can I talk to her? Put your weapon away right now. No. There you go. Wow. What what kind of business are you doing up in here, dude? What the heck? This is interesting. Are you... Is this the bad guy? I'm starting to piece some stuff together. I mean, going off of the memory of how he looked when I first saw him, and this disastrous contraption that looks like it's about set up for world domination... Is this the bad guy? This seems Have bittersweet. The chip? Yeah, look. Look at this guy. Is he the bad guy? Have you found the chip? Okay, don't yes. Give me one moment. The chip is initializing. You're, 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 there it goes. Self-test is grain. Reboot is good. Ha! It's working! And it looks like we have... Oh, I forgot winner. to check the days. Uh, oh, you've... You've saved us. You've done it. You're welcome. You saved the vault. You should be proud. But now we... There was nothing. Your report. We'll get it from you in the library. Please, go there now. Don't send me to a library. Seems insulting. Are you making fun of me? What am I supposed to... Like a new mission or something? So is that it? Pip-Boy? No more. 
Oh, man, I really wish I, I forgot to check how many days we had left. But we knew we had 116. We got that message. I, if I remember correctly, I think that message pops up at about 100 days. So we were somewhere at 100 days or just underneath. We did pretty good. A lot better. I, I was concerned we might not even get this water chip. So I was going to obviously end the series and progress to probably Fallout 2. But we can continue with this before we head to Fallout 2. If it's something people keep watching. But also, I do I do enjoy the series, and I do enjoy playing it. Um, so, like, what? Do I gotta find the next mission and stuff? Well, that'll be a video for another time. Thank you for clicking. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe, like, and comment. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Mission success. You got the water chip. Not that it matters, but it is a pretty helpful tactic that I use, I feel like. Um, the reason I have my hood up, mainly for the headphones, it bugs my ears bad if I've been doing this for a little over an hour. Like, it bugs my right one specifically bad. And also, too, I've been seeing a lot of um, content about like how uh, gamers and streamers will have like dents in their head from the headset. And I almost feel like I have a slight, almost permanent dent from maybe when I was a younger kid just playing video games all the time. So now I just wear things a little differently, and in all honesty, these kill my ears. Like any any headphones like these just kill my ears. So I put the hood up, it softens the blow for, lets me last a little longer. And I roll this a little forward. I don't have to worry about any dents in my head, which is just crazy. Use, useful information, I guess? Probably useless information, I don't know. Let me know. Put it in the comments. Thank you again, subscribe. Well, that was a successful day.